if we broke up do we have a plan b no i like literally like who you would go to next like who you would date next oh hell no no hell no i'm a little more practical like i literally have plan b's i don't know if i would go back we're not to putting this in there we're not putting this in there though we're yes we oh, stop yes we are it's a question it's fun Honestly, my plan B would probably be Amber, Amber's Closet. And then my plan C would probably be Stevie. I would have Prissa in that? there, but she's married. What? Are you f***ing Bro, stop. Stop. No. What's up, Neezy gang? Gang, 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 gang. Okay, look, really quick before Easy comes in. All right, right now we are about to film a challenge real quick where we are basically answering your question. She sent you guys a text message asking you, what will we do if we broke up? All right, but what she doesn't know is I'm gonna throw a little curveball into those questions and I'm basically gonna say that I would date her friends if we broke up. And we're gonna see her real reaction. She is not going to even expect it. So do not worry about the next little intro that we're gonna do with little Tink Tink because she does not know, okay? What's up, Nisi Welcome to our channel. Welcome to the latest channel on YouTube. And if you're new, mm. I'm Young Easy, mm. and I'm Natalie O'Dell. And we are best friends. No. And now, lovers, lovers and friends. Why are we so in sync? I freaking love you, <laughs> guys. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Okay, so today it's about to get hot and spicy, y'all. I love these challenges. They keep requesting us to do. I know, honestly, I have more fun like doing challenges with you than pranking you. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, that's a tough one because pranking you is extremely fun. It's annoying. But I love being able to interact with you instead. Oh, baby. <laughs> okay, so today's challenge that they have asked us to do, which will never happen, my guy. Ever. 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 We're doing the what if we break up challenge. Natalie, tell them what this challenge is. It's getting so spicy too. We basically asked you guys to ask us questions about what if we broke up? what would happen yeah. like what are your concerns and stuff yeah. because as you know yeah. a lot of youtube couple pages out there they don't be lasting they, don't they last really you, don't they'll last maybe a year or two and then the fans end yeah. up having to go through heartbreak with them yeah. as they part ways so yeah. but the thing is remember we're not a youtube couple i mean we might have got together on youtube but we best friends we at the end of the day we we <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let's get into it. We, I'm actually feeling quite inquisitive on what you're actually going to say. I guess you'll find out. Let's get into it. All right, so the first question, here we go. If we broke up, who would move on first? Ooh, Natalie for sure is what? moving on first, bro, because I love her more. That's I, I would lie. never move on. Let me I'll, tell y'all why, why she would move on first. Bro, what? She would move on first, but it would be a facade, okay? She would probably be traveling, <laughs> living it up. She'd be in the club if COVID's over. She would have all kind of girls Look with her. What does she think about me? Like, that is exactly how she is, though. She She's like those like those memes where the guy tries to Natalie! cover up how he really feels, okay? Whatever. I think that she would move on first. I ain't got a long explanation like this i just think she would because i never move on okay next we'll see about that next question <laughs> all right the next question is if we broke up who would take the youtube channel Ooh, damn i ain't think about that i mean if we if we broke up that's the challenge i just gotta accept it because it's hard for me to even say that because y'all know me how much i love that's me amazing. No way, huh? Okay, so what I would do, I honestly would be like, look, we built this YouTube channel together. You know what I'm saying? So if I tried to continue this by myself or she tried to continue it by herself, I feel like it will flop because that's not why people subscribe to us. We're at 600, oh, 600K? Almost, almost, almost 600K, get it 600K. Okay, okay. but I feel like the negotiation, because there's still a fan base, I would ask you, you know, you could post on there, I could post on there, we can have different stuff, but then again, we have our own YouTube channels already to do that. I probably I post 
we probably had to figure it out. Yeah. Or what we could do is probably use it as like a promotional channel. Oh, okay. For both yeah. of our separate stuff that we're doing. That's a good idea. Yeah. But it's not gonna happen. Ever. Ever. Next question. Okay, so the next question is, if we broke up, would you take everything you gave each other back? That is so petty. I would not do that. Yeah, that's, that that's like high school. It. That's high school. I, I would do, I wouldn't, I would consider in high school, but I never thought about it. But only because I taught myself an Indian giver is messed up. If the person I was dating turned into that, yeah, that prettiness, that Childish. I, I would be like, oh my God, thank God. I dodged a bullet. Yeah. And that, that means is... they only got it for, what did they get it for? They didn't get it to actually make you happy or they thought you liked it. They Let got me it ask you something. I got a good question. Okay, go. If we broke up. Don't say it. That's the next question. I already would know. Would you still wear the stuff that I got you? Loud and proud. Like, would you be on Instagram with it out? Would you still wear all the I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to lie. For the first couple of months, I probably wouldn't. I probably, it depends how we broke up. Because if we broke up and I did something to you, which would never happen. But if I did something to you, I possibly would like, all right, like I would still wear it. But if you did something to me, even if I really, really liked it, I would give it at least like uh, six months to a year to wear it. <laughs> so hopefully I forgot about you by then. Yeah, yeah. By then it's just like, all right, it just obviously I got it. I'm not gonna throw my shoes away, my Jordans. Nah, if they're Jordans, I don't care. I'm wearing them, bro. What if about anybody, the Yagas? The Yagas, I'm wearing them too. I'm wearing them too. But if it's like a chain that obviously you bought me, like you know those sentimental things, I probably six months to a year. I'm you? wearing it. I don't care. I do not care. Of course, care. you got a bust down Rolex, some bust down earrings, a bust down diamond bracelet, a bust down necklace. She got a bust down everything, and everything I get her is like, it's fly. So you gotta wear it. I'm gonna act like I'm not offended by you acting like the stuff I get you is not fly. Next question. <laughs> <laughs> no. What, first off, we're not gonna move on because I was just saying the sentimental stuff. Like, all right, let's just move on. <laughs> okay, so the next question is, if we broke up, who would keep the money? Ooh. Who keep the money? I mean, that's an easy question. We split it, yeah. That's an easy question. Yeah, neither yeah. of us. We want to have started a business with each other right. if we felt like we couldn't trust that yeah. in each other. Like, yeah. Even, even if anything, yeah, there's just... Because we are our own individual brands, and I feel like because we're so mature, I think that's... Like, we don't even have to think about that. Yeah. Like, oh, who's going to get the money? Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It doesn't yeah. even like, come like that. It's barely clear what was made together and what was exactly. made separately. So yeah. we would just split, split it. the stuff that was made together. Split. If we broke up, who caused the breakup? Natalie. Me? Natalie, you want me to want to cause it for sure. Easy gang. What? Look, I feel like me and Easy Gang are here right no, now. No, first off, Comment Easy Gang. Comment below who y'all think. Y'all already know. We can't, we can't, I guess we can't really answer that. Y'all are the ones that are going to answer that question. Comment okay. below. Comment below. Y'all know. Be be, the cause? It'd be her. For sure. Look at this girl. Who would it be? Next question. All right. If we broke up, who gets the dogs? Well, that's obvious. I do. What is obvious about that? What First, are you talking about? Wait, them? What? We were there my dogs. I, wait, we would have to split custody. What? <laughs> what? Okay. First wait, what? Of, did you or did you not ask me? Okay. To co-parent with Pluto. Did you not ask me? First of all, I, I co-parent. I said co-parent both of them, boss and Pluto. Wait, first of all, you called, you would always call me boss's stepmom. I did. And then, but you called he me became Pluto's. A, no, he be, you became his real mom, So naturally. what is so funny then when I say we would split custody? Huh? What's so funny? Exactly. We're splitting custody of them babies. Well, I like, I like that. I like that. I like that you said that. You know? mm -hmm. I'm gonna come and pick them up and take them to the park. Mm -hmm. Shit, but where they gonna sleep? You got an apartment. Where they gonna sleep? By then, I'm gonna have a mansion. So, <laughs> cause we never break up. All right, next question. You supposed to say there is no thing. Oh, I said that. I said no. cause we never gonna break up. No. <laughs> if we broke up, who's more likely to try and sabotage the other person's next relationship? Natalie. 
Yeah, for sure. Why do for you sure. think that? Heavy, for sure. Oh yeah, yeah for sure. No. Yes. I wouldn't even have time to sabotage. I would be too busy loving myself. What? And You'd be hurt first off. If I broke up with you, if you, you would definitely try to sabotage my next girl. If you sure. broke up with me, by the time you got to your next girl, I would literally not even talk to you anymore. Ooh. So there is no, I'm like a horse in a race. What kind of race? Like, in, in a race. Okay. Like the Kentucky Derby. Okay, I don't right. know if it was a horse so, in the you know when they have the blinders on oh. and they can't see or not, I would literally not be able to see her anymore. It would be like this. Girl. Eyes on the prize. <laughs> Get out of here with your eyes on the prize in it. If we broke up, who would be the one to announce it? Oh my god. Me. Literally the day of. I swear. No, probably the end. Oh, not even the geez. day of. I'm telling y'all, y'all would be the first to know. Y'all would probably know before I know. Yo. All right, it would, she would be tweeting it in the moment of us breaking up. Yeah, I would it's be the first. Y'all. I'm not going to lie, I'll be the first. You already know. You already know. I'm the type of person who She's I like street. to just take my time with stuff. My emotions are my emotions. When yeah. I'm ready for everyone to know about stuff, y'all know. Yeah, definitely. She got trigger fingers. Yeah. Twitter fingers, as I should say. <laughs> if we broke up, who would still be cool with the fam? Me. Natalie. Me, because your mama Foxy loves me, yeah. and your grandparents love me, so you would still have to see me at Christmases, at birthdays, maybe she not would. yours. You're gonna basically have to introduce your new girl to me as a part of the family. Sheesh. I'm just gonna be around. <laughs> me and me and Mama Foxy are like this. Yeah, definitely, for sure, for sure. If we broke up, would we still remain best friends? Oh, baby, I'm not gonna lie, I don't know, cause we deep. That's tough. We're deep in it, baby. But then again, Are we deep or not we're deep? Super like deep. deep in them guts deep. <laughs> anyway, it, it would be tough because we are so in love, but yeah. then at the same time, she really and truly is my best friend. Like y'all don't see us when the cameras are off. Y'all yeah. see such a small percentage of our lives. Literally a little bit. Yeah, they used do, to though. They used to see it when we were just best friends and we didn't have a YouTube. I know, see I more. know, yeah. I know, yeah. But I'm saying, like, y'all can only see what we show you. Yeah. But it's literally all we do is clown and crack jokes all day, every day. I think that we wouldn't remain best friends at first. Yeah. But I think maybe after a few years when we probably both moved on and healed and all of that, we'd probably yeah. get hella close again. Yeah. And it would probably be an issue with It'd the be people an issue we're dating. Because we would get right back together. She'd be cheating on her next person. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it. She have an issue staying faithful. Period. You would have an issue staying faithful. Period. If we broke up, do we have a plan B? Oh, I mean, what? You taking plan B? You taking yeah, plan B? not like that. Like, do we have backup plans? Oh, like, who we, like, what would happen? I mean, I never thought about a backup plan, but I guess, no. Like, you I never mean, thought of one? No. Like, what? Who thinks? If you think like that, I feel like you're planning for your, 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 I guess your relationship to fail. No you know? way. I like, think honestly having a backup plan is the most responsible way to be. Like, well, I guess like if we, like our YouTube channel, like our- No, I, like literally like who you would go to next, like who you would date next. Oh, hell no. No, hell no, no. Why would I? That's just like, all right, I'm over here scoping girls out on Instagram or something like that. Like, all right, me and Natty break up. Oh, I'm gonna go hurt him, hurt him. Oh, definitely that booty. <laughs> yeah. Like, no, who does that? I no. mean, I'm not gonna lie. Like, that sounds romantic and all, but I'm a little more practical. Like, I literally have plan Bs. Baby, you don't have a plan B? Like, how would you have a plan B? You know who you would date? Or like, yes. you Yes, like, I literally know who would, who's one, attractive enough, who seems like, you know, they would be make a good match. You know what I'm saying? Wait, we're not about to put that in there. Why? Bro, I'm not about to, you serious right now? Say yes to, like, you serious? I promise. Why would I? I'm I'm serious. That's normal. People do that. I'm Bro, actually no. surprised that you don't have a plan whoa, whoa, B. Whoa, what do you mean? What do you, what do you say? Plan B, probably C. And well, there's D. a few that have caught my eye while we've been together. That I'm like, if me and Easy didn't work out, I will probably give them a shot. Say swear, 
So we swear. You're smiling. You swear. <laughs> I'm just so, it's so weird that you think I'm joking. I thought you would you would say that? Me. Why would you say that? Well, no, you, it's like you said, we gonna work Bro, out, we're so not putting not. that in there, bro. We're not putting that in there. We're not. You literally, why would you, why would you have a plan B? That's literally like you're hoping this is gonna fail. I, I'm not hoping, but I'm prepared if it does. Bro. Success is when preparation meets opportunity. And if I ever had the opportunity to okay, be well, who? single again, I would. Who would you literally have a plan B with? And would you even go back to men or women? Like, bro, I don't know if I would go back to men. We're not putting men. this in there. We're not putting this in there. Yes, we oh, stop. Yes, we are. It's a question. It's fun. Honestly, my plan B would probably be Amber, Amber's closet, and then my plan C would probably be Stevie. I would have Crystal in that? there, but she's married. What? Are you fucking serious, bro? Stop. Stop. They're cute. They're super so cute. So you're talking about those are your plan B and C? And you said you would go to Krista, but she's but married? But she's married. That's why I said she, Krista's cute too, but I would never because she's married. So you've been looking at my friends, bro? Are you kidding me right now, bro? Stop playing. You say you really, don't say this on camera, bro. So, oh. Don't say this on camera, bro. <laughs> I don't know why you're acting like that. Acting like what? You're why would you say weird. that? So you've been looking at my friends, bro? I'm I literally at all the girls I've ever. I that they're cute and that they're sweet. Bro, don't say That's that shit it. again. Bro, don't say that again, bro. Don't say that again, bro. We're not filming this. We're not posting this, period. I don't care, bro. That's disrespectful for you to even... Okay, fine. I'll let you maybe slide or the freaking plan B. But the fact that you say my friends... But it has to not be your friends. There's only so many people in the gay community. Like, who would I go to? It has to be somebody that already is making content because then I would start a channel with them, too. You know what I'm saying? It wouldn't make what? sense to just go to, like, somebody who's not an influencer. So you've been looking at my friends. Yes or no? They just happen to be your it's friends. It's funny. It's funny. Dude. I was looking at them before. They were even your friends. Bro, that's weird, bro. You're, you're weird. We're not posting this shit. I've never felt this weird with you ever in my life. Bro, I don't even <laughs> want you around my friends. It's not funny. I don't want you around my friends. Period. And, and like, bro, what? That's like me saying that about Jasmine. Keep it. You really literally think about that, bro. said that me and Jasmine are like the same person and how we look exactly the bro, same. And you're super never, attracted bro. to me, so bro. that must mean you're super attracted to Jasmine. No, I think Jasmine is beautiful, but that's not my plan B. I don't know. That's weird, bro. That's not, I'm not, I wouldn't say that shit. That's so weird, bro. Like, why would you say that about my friends? Now, and the thing is, the last thing that I am is insecure. And me oh, thinking like, insecure. I'm not acting insecure, bro. The fact that I literally have my friends around you and you over here plotting and scheming, bro. Oh my God, now you're being dramatic. I'm no, not I'm plotting. Not yes, you yeah. are. I literally left my friends in the room with you by yourself because I'm that secure. A lot of girls don't do that. Like a lot of girls won't even give their, their friends, their girlfriend's number because they're that insecure. Bro, we are friends. We're best friends. And you say you're talking about you got a plan B with my homies. Stop smiling, bro. Cause I, bro, I swear to God, bro, you're weird, bro. You're weird, bro. You're so weird. Easy, I'm joking. Obviously. What is wrong with you? Of course my plan B and C are not your friends. My plan B and C are my friends. No, I'm just playing. I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm joking. No, I don't have a plan no. B and C. No. I don't have a plan B and C. Yeah. I'm, I promise. Bro, I'm about to put the camera. Stop. Don't cut the camera. Stop. I'm serious. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Yeah, okay. right, so, so why would you say that on camera then, I was bro? joking. It's a prank. How is it? We literally just did a whole challenge. I, I text. I texted these people. They texted me. How is it a prank? Okay, but I had to throw a prank question and answer in there. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. <laughs> she ain't like that one, y'all. Okay. Hey, look at me. I don't have a plan B. I'm literally looking dumb right now. Talking about I now never happened. <laughs> Ew. Jesus. Jesus I'm third. Cut the camera, bro. All right, easy game. All right. She showed me the footage, y'all. She showed me the footage. All right, I believe you. I, I was just do, joking. I didn't think he was going to throw that in there like that. Yes. Uh, you got to stay on your P's and Q's. Jeez. Stay on your toes you with Natalie you... Odell. Okay, sign us out. You just said you like challenges more than you like pranking me, bro. I said I might.
Damn. Pranking you is too fun. Jeez. Sign us out. All right, Nisa Gay, make sure you guys like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. We're the one of the latest couples on YouTube and best friends. You know what I'm saying? The only. One of the. The only. All right, y'all, make sure y'all subscribe. Give this video a thumbs up and spam the comments. That helps us get popped up on your feed, okay? Follow us on Instagram and yeah, Nisa Gang. Oh, and TikTok. Nisa Gang, we are out. Thank you.